Woodstock Fruit Festival. We'll see you there, August 20th, 28th, 2012. Here we have our latest date delivery. What do you think, Jerry and Rada? I think all this sugar is going to make us fat again. We're going to get fat again. We've just lost all the weight from eating high fat diet. And now we're going to get back on the sugar. We're going to get fat again because I'll be getting obese after 11 years. So obese. seriously, we have the medjules. That's good. And then you got Zahidi and the whole hello. <laughs> oh, yeah, so, hello. Hello. My mate, look at that. Look how soft that is. Canary, canary as well. Hello. So I did the math. This is about $720 US. And I made an incorrect estimate yesterday. It's about $720 US for these. How long will it last us? That's a good question. Only about three days, I reckon. <laughs> Maybe three weeks. I'm going to eat a box a day. That's my goal, a box a day. I'm probably going to have about 60, 60 dates a day. So these are medjool, medjool dates, the ones that you find commonly in health food stores, but these are straight from the grower and they're amazing, juicy and fresh, a lot of the ones you get in the health food store. A little bit old and Look at that. Oh, there's That's a green little hand coming in to steal one. Squishy. Look at that. Date sugar. <laughs> Nutrition. Stop it. Nutrient Stop dense. It. Nutrient dense. All right, get out of <laughs> What are these ones? These are, is this a honey date? Honey on yep. toast? Honey, honey on toast, toast date. What about this one? Halawi. Halawi. Honey on toast. Yep. Halawi. Halawi. And these are stories, man. They gave you a story Halawi. sample pack. Yep. Are these good? This is called the peanut butter, mate. It's the peanut butter. Oh, I mm. don't eat all them. Oh. Oh. oh, get out of it. That's peanut butter on toast. you got to watch this one. Mm. Leave them alone for five minutes. Okay, yeah, see? And they're gone. And what are, they, are these? Are these Kadari or something? Kadari. The camera girl with the banana stash. Kadari. Oh, yeah. And Sugar. And it's our bananas. We hate carbs, as you can see. Carbs make you fat. I'm doing it right for the anorexic. And what are these? Are these the same? Are these honey and toast? Honey and toast again? Yep. Oh, we've got three boxes of honey on toast. I'm very happy about that. Toast and what about these last ones? They're Hawalis as well. Hawalis. I think we've got Kadari somewhere. Uh, the Kodaris are the honey on toast. Oh, okay. There we go. Look at that. Look how soft that is. Soft and gooey. <laughs> it's the original caramel. Incredible. What a magical fruit, the date. Mmm. It's so sugary. Mmm. Wow. Fresh dates, man. Doesn't get better than this, does it? Mmm. Look how soft and good these are. Little bits of caramel. Sugar. Finger licking good. Seriously, dates and bananas are the most important foods in the raw food lifestyle. Um, excuse me, we're filming in here. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. Get out, please. This is a studio recording. Constant distractions. Dates and bananas are like the key foods for weight loss. Why? Because they keep you off the junk that is full of salt and grease and crap. They keep, they, they, they're the foods that keep you slim. <laughs> People say, no, that's not true. Bananas and dates make you fat. And I'm like, where the fuck are the fat people that eat bananas and dates in the long run? I don't know what I have to do. I don't know how slim me and Freely have to get. Do I have to lose another 20 pounds? Does Freely have to lose another 20 pounds before people go, well, actually, maybe, just maybe, bananas and dates are slimming. <laughs> it's hilarious. But anyway, so bananas and dates are key. If you want to succeed on raw foods lifestyle, if, if you like doing raw foods, which I'm assuming that's why you watch my videos, if you like doing the raw foods, you like the weight loss, you want this slim, toned, tight, slim, flat stomach, body, tight, without drugs, without starvation, without orthorexia, anorexia, binge purge, intermittent fasting, nonsense, whatever. If you want the lean gains, fruits of friend, bananas and dates, that's the staples, man. Buy in bulk. Buy in bulk. Don't go to the shop and buy a kilo of dates. 
I mean, that's good for a day, but get the boxes, man. Get the bulk savings. You can see in Australia, Australian fresh produce is more expensive than any other place on earth. Why? Because we don't have any competition, really. So local growers can charge what they want, and that's fine. I don't really mind paying whatever because I'm a fruit addict. I'm like a heroin addict. I'm a fruit addict. I'll do whatever it takes to get the money to get the fruit. I'm like, if this is quality, I'll fucking pay whatever. I'll pay 50 bucks a kilo for this shit, man. This is so good. This is A-grade quality, man. This is the gold. This is like <laughs> triple A-grade killer dates, man. Not even organic, but they taste so good. You can't get organic Australian dates. There's no certified organic grower in Australia. How lucky are you to live in the US? So if your goal is weight loss transformation with raw foods, make bananas and dates your staples. Have those as your have meals of bananas and dates every day. Blend bananas, make Daterade, put them together, whatever. Bananas and dates, bananas and dates, bananas and dates. That's just how it is. If you want to get slim and be high energy, bananas and dates. If you want to get off the raw crack owl, off the raw stimulants, off the raw drugs, get bananas and dates in, get rid of the honey. Get rid of the processed sugars like refined sugars like xylitol, agave, yacon, lacuma. Get rid of those toxic refined sugars. Add in the natural sugars from the fruit. Get rid of the toxic honeys that steal food from the bees. So then the bees experience colony collapse disorder. Just eat more fruit. If you, and if you get rid of the honey, what is happening is you're getting rid of all those toxic pollens which can cause weight gain. Honey can cause weight gain because of the toxic pollens can cause inflammation and edema so you can get puffy. You're not still doing any fat, but you're just getting fat, fat retention, water retention, edema from the pollens in the honey can cause inflammation. So it's like when someone's on a medication, the body's having a, a slight toxic effect to it and you get fatter and fatter. When you're, you're not getting fatter, you know what I mean? You're getting edema, so it looks like you're getting fatter, but you're just getting bigger. That's a better way to say it. So honey can make you bigger, make you a puffier, bloated bum, etc. Bananas and dates, Get on them program, smash them down, 30 bananas a day or 80 dates a day, whatever. Just chow down, enjoy, live your life of passion, get in touch with your life purpose. No time for exercise, only time for living. No downtime, no free time, no spare time, no holiday time, just lifetime. Every day is a day. Sugar up, we'll see you on the road. So share this video with anyone who says fruit makes you fat or dates, bananas make you fat or whatever. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you want to see more of these videos, share it on Facebook, Twitter, etc. And post your comments and questions down below. Where do you get your dates from? What's your favorite date dealer? What's your favorite variety? What do you think of the peanut butter date? Do you like it? Do you not like it? What do you think? Post your comments and questions down below and say good day to Blinky Bill.